Hello everyone, I'm Celestia14, I can't Andrea Celestial, and last time we did things, and I'm sorry if I've not uploaded in the, like, upload new episodes the last few days, um, I was just taking a break. Ah, volume. To me. Bleh. Anyway, uh, ow. Wild Pokemon. My heart. Why you do this? Why do I not buy balls or repels? <laughs> Anyway, um, I'm not sure where we can go from here. But I do know that I hate all these wild Pokemon, because I want them. Eh. So I think, uh, oh, shoot. Ah, come on! This is so painful. Alright, uh, let's see if we can head back to that spot where we were last time. Uh, not by the house, uh, by the area we thought was a good place for, um, Kenneth's new allies to hang out. Uh, let's see. Alright. If I can avoid all these wild encounters, like, Jesus. <sighs> Alright, there we go. So I think we're gonna make our way to that spot before we do anything else. Come on. Eh. Eh. Ah, jeez. I thought that green flower had something important, so I was gonna be like, huh, what does this do? But I'm, what does this do? But I guess I was wrong. Ah, uh, come on. Avoid. Any tall grass, please. I don't wanna do this anymore. Oh! Hmm. Yeah, I'm already getting a picture of it. If we clear out some of the, the trees here, and use some of the wood that we cut down to create a platform... Yep, it's a done deal. <laughs> it might take all night, but we have an entire team of Pokémon that can make this go oh so much faster. Well, let's start. Time skip. So, you coming to the city looking for a job too? Nah, I got a good old job at home. I don't need the city life. Ah, well, what do you want to do then? I help take care of the entire island, making sure things are doing well and stuff. Things like a slacker I know would never get his hand. Ugh. Things a slacker I know would never get his hands dir dirty with. Uh, ah, I see. Well, we're here now, so you can gather your things and leave. Didn't I already bring everything? Did I really bring anything? After all, I've got a family here. My little brother's living in the city as a construction worker, or so I've heard. Can't wait to find him and give him a nice slam in the face. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh. Kenneth, good morning. Was it rough out there? Oh, hey, Talia. Nah, that was fine. I'm very, very sorry. I'm very, very sorry again. You know, about the whole... I said I was fine. Anyway, I need you and Stella to follow me. Stella, she's still sleeping, but... Kenneth, have you slept? You're more than welcome to come nap now. No, no. There's no time for that. I need you to wake up Stella and come with me. Right now. Come on, come on, hurry up! Kenneth, it took a lot of walking to get here. Please just hold on for a sec, okay? We'll be- we'll get there. Not an excuse. I feel like I can run- run a mile. Does- why does he have so much energy so early in the morning? Honestly, who knows? But I guess we could- what in the world? Dear Ossius. <laughs> eh? Eh? Huh? Huh? Well? <laughs> I'm not... Not bad, am I right? It took so long, but I finally- But I think it's finally done. But- But how? And- But where? <laughs> I can see that- the, I can see that the lady, lady is speechless. I bet none of you expected this out of me, huh? How were you able to build a house in merely one measly night? Oh, well that was super easy. It was really dark, so Vulpix lit the area. Tessie cooled us down when we needed to take a break. The car you helped me reach places that were too high. Everyone else contrib contributed in their own way. It was a group effort. Still, it's just all hard to believe. It's practically an, a miracle. Kenneth, is this your house? Huh? <laughs> no, this is your house, Talia. My house? I already have a house down by the river. But you have nowhere... But you have nowhere to even sleep, Kenneth. Oh, don't worry about that. I was gonna crash in that old shack when you mo two moved in here. But take a look at this, Talia. Talia, you're gonna love this. This door freaking slides open. How cool is that? 
Now we should really start moving your things to this place, which is going to take a while because it's... K Kenneth, are you alright? No, yeah, I I'm perfectly fine. Don't worry, my Pokemon will diff... Well... <laughs> Kenneth! Yeah, he's quite alright. He just fell asleep. Let's start... Let's move him inside. Then we'll, we'll start moving our things here. Okay. <sighs> mm, I must have passed out then. I guess I was way more tired than I thought. No worries. I wasted time. But I think I'll be okay. Hmm? Oh, you're awake. Finally. You really scared us back there, you know? Just collapsing on us like that? I didn't even realize how tired I... How tired I was. Oh, I don't know. It looks like you guys were able to put your... Th to put things here together with any problem. Oh yes, your Pokemon were a great help. Nice. If that's the case, I'm on... I'm going to gather them and work on getting that shed fixed up. Oh, well. Because honestly, eh. I can't, I can't read. Because honestly, I don't think I can build another house this soon. I see. Wait, Kenneth, I need to ask you something. Hmm? What's up? Remember when you told me that you wanted to ask me a really awkward question? Well, it's my turn to ask you something just as awkward. Out with it, yeah? Well, I don't know if this is a be if this is based on Vivian's influence on me or anything. But there's something I want to do, regardless of whether or not what I said is true. Yeah? I... I want to rebuild... rebuild Sheridan Village. You want to rebuild Sheridan Village? Are you sure? Yes, I'm very sure, actually. But I wanted to ask if it's not too much. If you could, um... Help you rebuild it? I understand if it's too unreasonable. I'm not going to pressure you into, into it or anything. Sure, I'll do it. Really? You've accepted it. You've accepted it so quickly. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> if I can build one house, I'm sure I can build many more. Just not all in one night again, probably. But it's a lot of responsibility. If I can rebuild the village, there's... A there will have to... Oh. Uh, I can't read. I'm so sorry, guys. If I rebuild the village, there will have to be another leader. Another sensei. I'm sure you could do it. I don't really have any qualities to be one, though. Okay, how about we both become sensei? T two senseis in one village? Is is that allowed? It's our village. I think we can make the rules, right? Yes. Yes, you're absolutely right. Thank you. Thank you so much, Kenneth. For the first time in so long, I'm, I'm so happy. I'm so very happy, and I don't know how to express myself. I'm sorry. There's a lot of There's a lot to plan and a lot to do. There's a huge cliff with a... Oh, there's a huge cliff with a waterfall just north of here. Ugh, I can't read. I'm so sorry, guys. I can't tell who's talking anymore. <laughs> oh, the one with the huge pile of rocks in the middle? Yes, the very same one. Could you meet me there? Sure thing, Talia. I'll be there soon. Thank you. All right. Woo! So let's go uh, meet her up at that place. If I don't bump into Pokemon on the way. And here we are. Kenneth, you made it. Listen, there's this huge pile of rocks here. I don't know how to go about it, but I think we should unearth them. Sure thing. Um, but, um, why? I think we could be able to build our house here. It's a really convenient place. We can see the whole village from this high up. Uh, our house? Uh, oh, I'm sorry. Is that weird? I, I just thought that both of the leaders should be close together often. No, it's a fine idea. Let's build it then. Wonderful. Now, do you have any ideas? I don't suppose we could do this with your Pokemon? Not sure on one, on that one. My Pokemon aren't strong enough to destroy terrain just yet. The Karya may be able to blast away, but it would, it'd take a few hits that, and that wear her, out, wait her, ugh, wear her down. Hmm, what to do? Oh, I may have a solution to this problem. Back then, when Celia and I were attacked by those thugs, they threatened to blow up our house if we didn't comply. It's true that the entire team disbanded, but it's possible that they left some explosives behind. Explosives, huh? That sounds dangerous. If it's too dangerous, we can think of something else? No, it's okay. I think I can handle it. Hmm, okay. But if they look too unstable, I want you to leave them and come back here immediately. I can't have my new best friend in pieces after all. I just met him. Eh, I just met him. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Alright, so we're going back for those explosives, and I'll actually cut to when I get there, so I don't trouble you guys with all the encounters and that, so I'll be right back, okay? Hey guys, I'm back! Uh, I came here and accidentally took one of the diamond, because there's, th there's three of them here, so I'm sorry about that. I, I was like, oh shoot, I forgot to record. So, uh, we're back at the base, 
and you just take these dynamites. All right, that should be enough. Let's head back. Oh, okay. We get to save the walking. Yay! Thank you, game. You pity me uh, for once. Alrighty. So now we'll just walk up to Talia and give her give her this. But what? I feel like there's an invisible force there. I know it. <laughs> anyway, let's deliver these. There. All the charges have been set. I hope this is enough. This is all they had down at the base. Talia? Oh, I'm sorry. I was just thinking about something. On some second thought, maybe we should leave this cliff alone. Huh? Why? I thought this place was going to be where we built our home. No, I know, but the thing is, I don't really know how to explain it, but I can feel something moving underneath this rock. You can feel it? It was only for a second, but it was probably just my imagination, but... Talia, everything will be fine. Just trust in me. No, you're right. You're right. I need to stop worrying. Okay, I'm going to light the charges. But not before you take a cover. Right. <laughs> nice spot. Alright, okay, Vulpix. Light a flame! <sighs> Alright, let's get out of here, Lucario! Wow, that might have just been enough. And awesome! That, Those rocks went pretty deep into the ground, though, yeah? Left this huge crater in the ground. That's gonna be a pain to fill. Um, yeah, that was a... Ah! Talia? Wh what was that? <gasps> oh, fuck. What is that thing? I've never seen this thing before. No. Not again. No. It doesn't matter. I have to deal with this now. Lucario, let's go. Oh, shit. I didn't realize we were going to be in a battle. Oh, crap. Hello, Mystery Beast. What's up? What? Oh, man. I'm going to be regretting this, aren't I? Okay, it's a... Uh... Okay. What? Oh, shoot. That's not good. What the heck? Okay. Alright. Oh, shoot. Um, well, I didn't predict this. At all. Okay, I think I need to do some off-screen training. What the heck? I did not predict this. Oh, please stay alive, Tessie! Shoot. It's too overpowered. Wait, what if I just tried it that way? Crap. Yeah, I'll have to train these guys off screen a little bit. I didn't expect it to be this bad. Ah, poop. <sighs> I'll be back, you guys. Uh, I'll be back when these guys are stronger, so give me a bit, alright? Okay, apparently there's more dialogue. It took me down with no problem at all. No! Stay away from me! Stay away! Talia! I won't let you! I won't let you take me again! Not again! Not again, not again, not again! Not again! Whoa, what the fuck? I didn't realize there was more dialogue, so yeah. Uh, what happened? Lucario! It's gonna be okay, buddy. I have medicine, see? Everything's gonna be just fine. Just hang in there. Thank you. Lucario, did you just... Kenneth! Kenneth! Uh, I can't do voices. What happened? I heard Talia scream! Huh? Oh my god, Talia! We were attacked by this... by this... jellyfish thing! I don't know how to describe it! I'm not even sure that thing it was a Pokemon! Did you just say jellyfish? Y yes, it was spouting out of poison and rocks. It was weird. Negalia. Where's Talia? She still must be on top of that hill. She screamed when, and then there was this blinding light that knocked Lucar Lucario and I down- uh, Lucario- <coughs> Lucario and I off the hill. Come, Kenneth. We must see if- See that she is okay. R right. Return for now, Lucario. Let's go. Talia, are you okay? Speak to me, Talia. Talia, can you hear us? Please. Uh Kenneth? Oh, thank God. You know you gave us a heart attack and a half? What was that bright light? Where did Nagalia go? Nagalia? Nelia go- I can't pronounce its name. I said Nagalio. I don't know. I'm thinking it's Nagalio in this thing. I see. In the bright light, you see? Everything was clear. I am thoroughly tired of all this. All of this. Tired of what? 
So, yeah, you have the amulet, correct? Of course, I always carry it with me. Good. I believe it's time that we use that amulet. I understand. Do you have a place in mind? Yes, of course. There's a small secluded Isolan just south of the uh, house. I want to use it there. Understand, Scylla? Yes, I do. Kenneth, you come too. I need your help. O okay, got it. Oh, Lucario's okay. That's good. Alright, I'm just making sure my program's still here. Alright, let's let's go. Uh, what happened? I don't know. And I didn't know there was another cutscene, so... Yeah. I didn't think there was a cutscene if you lose, so... Eh. Can't blame me for that, can ya? I mean, I never played this before. Uh, but yeah, let's uh, head down here. Let's heal everyone. Maybe I should save in case. Yeah, I'll do it after. South of the house? Oh, they don't expect me to walk, do they? Oh, man. Well, they don't expect me to walk. They expect me to walk, okay. Alright, south of this house? Or you know what? I'll be right back, guys. Okay, so guys, I found them. Never mind. Okay, I'm here. What do you need me to do? Could you please clear the trees in the area and build a bridge to that secluded piece of land? Oh, um, sure, but that'll take a little while. Could you have it done by tomorrow morning? Absolutely. Good. Talia, the job the job is done. Wonderful job, Kenneth. Could you please move aside? Sure thing. Sil Celia? Yes. It's been years since I visited uh, this place. We can remember the good days once we once we get there. Understood. Activate. That's amazing. How'd you two do that? Kenneth. I yes, Talia? I know this is sudden, but please stay here. Uh-huh. I thought you needed my help. Where are you even going? Please, listen to what I say. Don't ask questions. I would like to tell you everything, but I just can't. And I know that puts a strain on things, but I'm just going to have to ask you to trust me on this. I... I understand. Stella, come. After that, Talia and I barely saw each other. Most days we saw each other, we just exchanged one word, greetings and farewells. Every evening, Talia would return back return back to the spot where she said Vivian's am using Vivian's amulet and disappear for the entire night. I couldn't help but feel like I've done something wrong to upset her. But work on the village continued regardless. Without Talia's help, I went on to map and complete a com huge sh section of Sheridan. The plan was to complete Southwest Quadrant in two weeks, but it took longer than usual. But I was able to construct two houses in a bridge. As long as, as long as it's finished, although, though my then my job is complete. But as complete as that is, I can't help but feel way less than that. What did I do wrong? Oh. <sighs> now, now, what's gotten you into such a l lackluster mood? Good afternoon, Stella. Don't worry about me. That answer is not acceptable. Tell me, what is ailing you? It's just that I feel like I've done something wrong here. Something wrong? Oh, pardon me. Ever since that day we encountered Nagalia, it's just, it just seems like Talia wants nothing to do with me. Which is so weird, because just before that, we were getting along so well. Talia cares about you, Kenneth. More than you realize. Yeah, well, she has a funny w way of showing it. Not that she owes me that or anything, I'm just... In a tight spot? I know how you feel. Long before all this, I used to have a boyfriend named S Sota. Wow, really? Where does that name sound familiar? Yes, even old farts like me have experience. Love at least once. We were so close. He was practically my best friend, but... But suddenly he just passed away one day. Later I found out he died due to some rare illness. That whole time we were together, he knew he was sick, and he never told me. Wow, that's really, um... Unfair? Yes, it was unfair. I would have liked to know. I still imagine how much more time I would have spent with him if I knew. But I wasted my time becoming a lawyer, and I missed out on something great. Why are you telling me this? Because this situation is similar. Simu similar. I can't speak. I don't want you to waste in something to do it. so great. Talia is burdened with something, but she's ashamed to open up to you. So what should I do? I think you and Talia should ha sit down and have a talk. You do like her, don't you? I do like her. A lot, actually. In fact, I've been thinking of... Then don't waste this moment because you may not get another chance. Uh, are you saying... 
Yes, you have my blessing. But you must get hers, too. I understand, Stella. Thank you for talking with me. I'm going to go talk to Talia right now. Wait, Kenneth. Huh? Could you please wait until tomorrow morning? It's quite late, and you know how Talia is when it comes to... I understand. Tomorrow, then. Yes, tomorrow. I think I'll head back and get ready for bed. Okay, night, Stella. Good night, Kenneth. Good luck. Tomorrow. Tomorrow will be the day. That can't be. Same beacon from back then? Wait, get back here! Uh, where did that beacon go? It was around here. So it has to be around here somewhere. I'm just gonna save in case. Where is it? Oh, you want me to go all the how dare you? <laughs> Dang, how dare you do this to me? No, I don't want to go all the way over there. No. Uh, we're walking. I think I have an idea where it went. In here. I finally cornered you, BHM. What the hell are you doing? What are you doing in the village? You better not be planning anything. What? Who the hell is this now? I understand. Come on, then. Please tell me this thing isn't stronger. Oh, okay, it's the same. I hate your psychic! I hate you. Shoot. Um. Oh wait, I got Leaf! What am I doing? I got Leaf! What am I ta talking about? <laughs> no, I can beat Leaf now! Good job, Leaf. Back. Uh. I think Volpix can handle it. Actually, no. Oh yeah, she can. She can handle it. All right, let's do this. Oh shit. Oh shoot. Good try. All right, Shira, you're up. Yes. Go for it, Shira. Come on, Shira. Yes! Thank you, Confusion. Phew. Magneton. Uh, the cry wasn't the best for this. I don't even know if I can hit it. Shoot. Oh, yes, I can hit it. Yes! Nice. <laughs> Alright, two more. King Clang. Okay, I don't think it's gonna hit you. Oh. Can I even try? Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Okay. Nope, I can't. Oh, wait. Oh, I could have. Okay. Let me try that again. Please do not get five. Okay, I'm dead. Bullpigs and. Oh uh, shoot. Altaria. Um. I need you to hold on. Uh, please. I need. Oh no, I don't have anything. Shoot! Crap. I fudged. I'm dead. Crap. Mm. Hair song. Gonna have to do it. Oh, you suck! Uh. Hey guys, I'll be right back. Give me a bit. Alright guys, we're back and we're gonna try to take down this trainer again. I don't know what their beef is, but I'm really g getting annoyed of it. Oh shoot. Oh hell no you ain't. Can you stop? Please? Get out of here. <sighs> okay. That's one. Alright, um... Uh... Mm. Let's go, Shira. Hang in there, Shira! Yes. If I can get rid of this muck. And please do not critical hit, hit me with that. Yes! Whew. You're out of here. Magneton. Okay, I'm gonna actually have full picks in for this one. Alright, we're gonna go heat wave. Oh, please don't kill. Oh no! I need a full picks. Fuck. Okay. Alright. Let's see how you like this then. Get out of here, Magneton. Get out of here. I don't want you here. Clang, clang. I'll still stay in with Lucario. Okay. 
Okay, then. Sword stance. Well, you can do this, guys. Good thing I'm part steel type, because that won't work on me. No, but that's gonna be painful. <sighs> Phew. Good job, Lucario. What's your last one? I'm scared to find out. What? Oh. That's not cool at all, bro. That's not cool at all. I'm gonna die. Oh, wait. Maybe I can use Eliminate to heal. Yes! Shoot. You're a poison dragon, so... I don't think I'm gonna win. Shoot. I tried. I could try Lucario. Oh, shoot. That increased your speed. It's up to you, Shira. Oh, shoot! That actually did a lot! That's not cool, man. That's not cool! Come on. Oh, too close. Yes! Uh, I need leaf just in case. I can't heal you, Arya. I'm sorry. Ah, uh, shoot. What am I doing? Hang in there, Leaf! Oh, come on! This is not fair! Jesse! I have faith in you! Sorta! Please! Yes! Thank you, Tessie! Holy crap, that was too annoying. What is your problem? That bee him is yours, right? Why are you following me around? Stop! Wait! God damn it, someone's screwing with me. I was so distracted with chasing that bee that I didn't even notice the time. I really need to get back to Sheridan. Hopefully that's the last of those two. Huh? Talia, it's so rare to see her out late. But maybe if she's out, this means that there must... She's more comfortable or something? Maybe I should wait. Shouldn't wait until tomorrow to tell her then. Maybe I should just tell her now. I know she doesn't want me to follow her through that war, but I have to do this. And I want to heal, so can I go in this? Oh, I need to go to that house. Oh, okay, there's a bridge here. Nice. I need to heal. I'm going to switch Altaria out. Oh, hi, Leaf. <laughs> Alright, let's switch for you, just because... Alright, let's go. Let's go after Altea. I mean, Tel Talia. Uh, I'm thinking of Altea here. Alright. That's the wrong house, but okay. I'm switching back to Lucario. Alright. Let's see what's beyond this warp. Oh, shit. Firestone. Nice. Oh, for Vulpix! Nice! I was wondering when we were going to encounter one. Alright. We get... Actually, we'll stop here. Because I think we are pretty far in. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time for, um... Ooh, that's a nice looking shiny. Shoot. So uh, yeah, guys. Um, this is all for this episode. Um, I'll see you all for the next one. Have a good day, everybody. Bye!